Greetings, everybody, and, um, quick update. So not only is Nintendo being incredibly stupid and, you know, partnering with YouTube so that they can take ownership of their videos off of YouTube, but now Microsoft has just announced with their video about this new Xbox One, which would have made a lot more sense if they called it Xbox 720, which is what I thought they were originally going to name it, which apparently they are not. They're calling it Xbox One. So now we have three Xbox consoles... And one of them's called Xbox One. This is the third console. What? Anyway, that's besides the point. So, it seemed like at first, through their, you know, their introduction of the video that they were, you know, they were... It was looking okay, and it's like maybe possibly kind of online. Like, like it, it looks weird, apparently. And um, I've not seen the video for myself. But I just got recently updated by a few friends uh, who have seen it and then did some research. Uh, then Microsoft announced something really stupid, but anyway, I'm getting there. I'm petting a cat while I'm at it, so excuse me. Um, so, yeah. So, the, apparently the controller looks great. looks like a regular, you know, Xbox controller. It's an Xbox controller. Pretty simple. Uh, the console looks apparently a bit funky. Um... Uh, it looked like it was going to be okay uh, until it struck. The rumors are true, everybody. Microsoft has made probably the hugest mistake that they've probably ever made in their entire reputation. They are banning pre-owned games on the console. And apparently if you buy the game... With the CD, you can install it once. No, I take that back. I take that back. I lied. You can buy the game for the Xbox One and install it once. Once, mind you. If your console crashes and you lose all your games, you're going to have to buy them all over again. So first of all, big mistake on that part. Um, second mistake is if you install a CD... On, and you apparently have to make an account on certain CDs, and apparently if there, if there is one CD attached to a special account, or more than one account, you have to pay a fee in order to install it. So, Microsoft has announced that you have to pay a fee to play pre-owned games in order to play them on the Xbox One. What? The heck? What the heck? Just what? Who would have thought that that was a fabulous idea? Oh yeah, you know, I got a brilliant idea for our, you know our next console. Oh, why is that, Jerry? Well, let me tell you, it's um, uh, it's um, we're gonna make the new Xbox. You know, it's gonna be the third one. We're first of all gonna we're gonna call it um Xbox 720, but we'll eventually change it to Xbox One just to flip people up. And then, but not only that, but I think we'll make a lot more money if we pay, have people pay a fee so that they can play other CDs on the Xbox One. Oh my gosh, you're such a genius, Jerry! Oh my gosh, just do it! Yeah, I know I'm a genius. What? 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 Why? I mean, I'm not a big Xbox player myself, but... What? First of all, we got Nintendo being stupid and, you know, claiming their videos if you rec their video games if you record it on YouTube. So, they're getting the money instead of you. And now Microsoft has decided that they're gonna release a console like this? I will be so shocked if this console is impressively sold. Like, if they sell, I bet you they won't even, they'll hardly sell. I mean, seriously, when I was looking up reviews and official reports and um, hearing other Let's Players talk about this stupid thing, like, they were like, why on earth would you even think about getting the game? And all the comments that I've seen on it are like, okay, it's obvious that they're not going to make it. Microsoft's going to go <laughs> down the drain super quick and super easy. So, just thought I'd let you guys know how freaking ridiculous Microsoft is being at the moment. Um, apparently there's another rumor going around that Sony's doing the same thing for the PS4, although I don't think that's true. I think PS4 
is going to be just fine. So, yeah. I mean, I had no intention of getting the new Xbox anyway, but this makes me just want to detest it. Like, just why? Why would you think that this was a brilliant idea, people? Why? Why? And they said, like, for the fee, you're going to be charging, you're going to be charged, not only you're going to be having to be charged for, you know, buying the game in the first place, but if you buy it and then try to install it on your Xbox One, they said that, or they claim that they're going to be charging you about 75% of the original cost of the video game. That's a lot of money. Just so you can play it. Now, of course, these are just, that part is just a rumor. So I could be incorrect. I'll keep you guys updated if I hear anything new. But, what? 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 I'm just gonna, I just gonna, what? Anyway, I'm gonna go and watch some good videos of people who aren't being stupid and creating consoles like this or are trying to, you know, make money off of their own freaking videos because they're freaking stupid and they're just uh, not being successful because they're not good at making their game consoles and their stuff. Really, people? Just let it die. Gah! Gah! Yeah. <laughs>